Dear student, today we are going to work problems in straight lines and pair of straight lines. The first problem is A, B, C are in A, P and X, Y, Z are in G, P. Then the points A comma X, B comma Y and C comma Z are collinear if four choices are given of which one is correct. Since the three points are collinear, the condition for collinearity is determinant A x 1, b y 1, c z 1 equal to 0. The condition for collinearity of three points having coordinates x 1, y 1, x 2, y 2, x 3, y 3 is determinant x 1, y 1, 1, x 2, y 2, 1, x3, y3, 1 equal to 0. I have applied this condition here. Let us simplify the determinant. The operation I am going to perform is subtract the first row from the second row. Subtract the first row from the third row r2 minus r1, r3 minus r1. So, this reduces to a x1, b minus a, y minus x, 0, c minus a, z minus x, 0 this is equal to 0. Expanding the determinant in terms of the elements of the last column, I get b minus a into z minus x minus c minus a into y minus x is equal to 0. This implies b minus a into z minus x is equal to c minus a into y minus x. Since you are given that a, b, c are in a, p, the difference c minus a is twice b minus a because a, b, c are in a, p. So, this further reduces to z minus x is equal to 2 into y minus x. Further simplification gives z minus x is equal to 2y minus 2x. Transposing to the negative terms to the left hand side, I will get 2y is equal to z plus x. Another condition given is x, y, z are in G P. That means y squared is equal to x z G P condition. Substitute for y from here as z plus x by 2. So, z plus x by 2 whole squared is equal to x z. Cross multiplying z plus x whole squared 4 x z. 
expanding the left hand side and bringing 4x z to the left hand side this reduces to z minus x whole squared equal to 0 that means z equal to x on substituting in any one of the relations we get this is also equal to y so x equal to y equal to z that is choice number 4 is the correct answer